Alright, what's up? Um, I had a, uh, had a request to do a ramped slow-mo tutorial in Sony Vegas Pro 9. Actually, I think you can use any Vegas Pro uh, program. I don't know. But I'm using Vegas Pro 9, latest version. Um, I, uh, what you want to do is go in, open up Vegas, uh, grab a clip, whichever one you want to you do it on. <coughs> I just use one of my friend, uh, uh, doing a key flip. Anyway, what you want to do is uh, get that clip and click anywhere in the clip and go to like right before he pops to do the trick. It doesn't, I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect. I'll, I'll do it about right here. And what you want to do is click S to split it. And you want to go over you know, two, and click S again, and just keep doing that. And so, I'll do it about right there. And then you want to zoom up so you can see all your, your clips. Uh, it doesn't have to be perfect. Like I said, uh, you just have to get it, get, I don't know, I don't know how many times I split it. But, uh, you want to have around 9, 10, 11-ish. If you don't, it's alright. What you want to do is take this last one, drag it. Drag it out so you have some room to work with. And you know, click this clip, hold control, click the outside, and it'll have that squiggly line under it. And pull it into where it says one. You see a one, and drag that over. And then you come over here, click it again so you get, or uh, hold down control until you see the squiggly. Click and drag. This time you're going to drag two. You see the two up here. And you just keep move, making your way up three four five and I usually go to six I don't know if I have enough clips or, yeah and then go back down to five and to four and three and the two and I'm just going to split this one just to have another clip and then get back down to one. Now after you have all those uh, split up, you're going to uh, move them back into place. And this is going to be a little difficult for me. You want to give yourself enough room. You want to move this back so you have enough room to work with. Uh, as you can see, I did not give myself enough room. <laughs> yeah, you want to get these all line back up together you wanna overlap each clip like so and once you get all these done oh, I sound like crap and you want to get the last one too. Once you get all those, you want to uh, you want to drag each one of the, just the sound. You want to drag that down into a new uh, a new track down here, and just drag them straight down, like the first clip that you uh, separated or split. You just want to drag that one down and drag the next one. Just keep dragging these down. Make sure you don't you don't move it over or anything. Make sure it has that orange line. So you know you're lined up. And just do that for these. And then when you get down here. Now what you're going to do. Is go into this. Right click. Properties. Lock to stretch. And you're going to do this for each one. Just keep locking the stretch. And you might not, uh, up here, uh, you might not have, it should, It might say nothing, or none, I mean. Just go down and click this, and just make sure your properties are all like this. Well, except for 
yeah, just make sure these two are the same and lock the stretch each one. And you should be good. Let's keep going that. Come on. Alright. Let's back out. That should be it. <laughs> it's not, then my bad. Alright. Now what you want to do is come over here. And you want to see, you see the volume. This should be 0, 0.0. Uh, make the bottom track. You can move it up. I'll move it up to like like 4.3. So just move it up. So it'll sound good. And just preview it. And uh, that's basically how you ramp slow-mo in Sony Vegas Pro. Alright, peace.